Thank you, Senator Santorum. <laughs> Governor Huckabee, in Afghanistan, the Taliban is strengthening. Attacks are on the rise and thousands more civilians have been wounded or killed. Much of the Taliban surge can be attributed to the withdrawal of U.S. forces there. You have expressed skepticism with the war there, saying you see no end game in sight. What then is your solution to the growing conflict there? Let me uh, put that in context. When I went to Afghanistan, I saw a land that looked like the land of the Flintstones. It was desolate. It was barren. It was primitive. And it's been that way for thousands of years. They, they want to take the world back to be just like that. We don't. We need to make a clear goal as to why we want to be anywhere in the Middle East. And I'll tell you why we want to be and need to be is to destroy radical Islam and everything that threatens civilization. It's not just a threat to Israel or to America. It's a threat to every civilized person on this earth. And we need to be equipping not only the Kurds in Iraq, we need to be making sure that those who are willing to fight radical Muslims will do it. But we need to never ever spend a drop of American blood unless there is a clearly defined goal. And we can't make sure we win unless we have a military that's the strongest in the history of mankind. We've got to rebuild our Navy. It's the smallest Navy we've had since 1915, when my grandfather got on a destroyer in World War I when he was in the U.S. Navy. We've got young men in Air Force B-52s, one in particular, he's flying a B-52 that his father flew in the 80s and his grandfather flew in the 50s. Those planes are older than me. We've got to have a military that the world is afraid of, use it sparingly, but when we do, the whole world will know that America is on their tail and they will be on their tail on the ground, never ever to rise up again. Governor Huckabee, if I could just follow up with that. Do we need to be in Afghanistan? Only if there is a concerted effort to destroy the advance of radical Islamists who are against us. As far as what are we going to make it look like, frankly, I don't know what we can make it look like. Uh, you can't create for other people a desire for freedom and democracy. And frankly, that's not the role of the United States. The role of the United States military is not to build schools, it's not to build uh, bridges, it's not to go around and pass out food packets. It's to kill and destroy our enemy and make America safe. And that's the purpose we should be there if we're going to be there. Thank you, Governor Huckabee.